Oh, it's a new dawn, it's a new day. And if you're gonna try and take over the world, you gotta start by making your bed. It's an average day in paradise today, but I have questions as to, you know, I own an Audi TT, I own a Land Rover Defender. Whose is that? Like, I'm, I'm not even kidding. I don't know whose that car is. I've never seen it before in my life. Do I have a new roommate? Either, either way, let's investigate. Hello, hello, hello. Nobody's responding to me. What? Morning, Stephen. Fee, fi, fo, fum. Of Ken. Oh. Wait. But there's Crocs at the back door. Surely that means my dad's here. Wait. My dad never goes anywhere without his Crocs. Is he hiding from me? Where the hell is he? I have genuine questions. But either way, we're going to start today because, you know, Alice is like wrapping and packing all the posters and stuff like that. Well, it's got to a point now where they can't currently work out of Alice's house because there's no internet. So they can't print orders, they can't do anything. So they basically just can't do the jobs. So I'm taking Defender, I'm going to drive around there, I'm going to load up the back with posters, bring them to here, and Alice and everyone's going to work from here for the day. Uh, that is if my Defender starts because I'm pretty sure I left my lights on last night. Whoops. And if I already had questions enough about the BMW, why is there two deck chairs out here and a rubber ducky? This is becoming some like weird conspiracy. Uh, hello? Is there someone in here? No. I'm seriously weirded out right now. I have many questions. Let's just calm this AC down real quick and add to the confusion of what the hell is going on because wham! There's a lot of tubes outside my house! Who put them there? Hey, what did you just say? Land Rover's assemble! Well, first of all, it's Defenders, but Land Rover sounds pretty good. <laughs> I bring your vehicle to put your stuff in. Tubes oh, go in here now, okay? To the extent we're now going to, to get the posters out here. Because I've moved into this house now. There's no internet and the hotspot is not working though. No internet for your house, no. No, guys, very nice. What very we nice, do, very do. Nice. How many tubes we have? Let me see. No tubes, they're all gone. That's nice. Hello there, Laura. That's it. Mum's no, done too. Okay. Yeah, I noticed them outside my house. Yeah, I said to work. Right. It's a lot of tubes. Okay, first of all, my mum needs to put the roof on a convertible because it's raining, and second of all... Hello? 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 Tube delivery? Hello? Yeah, it's raining. So, we've got all hours in. Oh, we've got a car. You've got a car with no roof on, mum. Thanks. Also, I have tubes. Is that for the, uh, lifeguard? <laughs> Actually. Yeah, <laughs> it is for lifeguard. When I tell oh, you, yeah. get out of my house. <laughs> all right, take... Two, let's do this thing! This Time to try and stack it a different way. Efficiency. Go on, in it goes. Come, 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 come. Also, we have this question. What is this on my sister's house? Like, what was that for? Ah! <laughs> Round two. Fight. Woman! 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 <laughs> this is just so sexist, but at the same time. Woman! <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, not you! I was shouting at my mum. I love my job. No, just carrying in tubes in the rain. If one of these snaps and they go rolling down my hill, I'm sorry, but 50 of you aren't getting your posters. <laughs> okay, not sure why I've got the cold AC on, but are you ready? Okay, let's get Alice's attention. <laughs> okay, maybe that wasn't a fun beep. Why have you done this to my house? Why have you done this to my house? You're the first person yeah, to eat one of them. Oh, really no, not these one missing, and I ate this one too. Oh, you fat bastard. Hello. I really want one! I really... Wait, wait, what? I, I said my thoughts out loud. I was saying I really want one of those chocolate, chocolate biscuits. Here you go. All yours. Enjoy. Yeah, there you go. They're the best. There's loads. Empty. Uh, okay, there was room in the garage, but now that's it. Oh, hi, Ken. Building together my dusty ass bike. Oh, they've not seen each other in ages. Oh. We keep in touch. Who's Nick, is it? Nick? Oh, they're mine. How to know when dad's at my house? Crocs. <laughs> Crocs. Better than socks. What are you making? Cheese and ham. Door stoppers. Door stoppers? What, just because of how thick the bread is? But that sounds horrible. I don't want to eat a door stop. Oh, they've got seeds in it. Oh, for God's sake, yeah. what's wrong with seeds? What's yeah. right with seeds? Birds eat them. Exactly, not humans. Mum, you know that I got a flamethrower? Yeah, I saw the one. Have you seen my burn? You idiot. <laughs> not that bad, are you joking? But like, E.T. gone wrong. I keep getting a pop-up being like, your disk drive E 
needs clearing for space, but I don't actually have a disk drive V. It turns out that Windows has randomly installed it onto my computer and like created it. Um, probably broke my computer. I followed a tutorial. It had 24 like ratings out of 24 like ratings, no dislikes to try and remove this drive. I followed all of his steps and I'm hoping it's working. Otherwise, I broke the beast. All right, moment of truth, computer turned back on. Opening up this, please. Yes, I've now only got two drives. I had in, like an extra drive that just like grew on my computer and it kept popping up, notifying me, notifying, notifying me. So when I was streaming, everyone could hear it going off like every 10 minutes. It was so frustrating, but not anymore. Mm. That looks sick. Go on, Alice. I turned up to my house and it was all unorganized, Mum. Anyway, Mum disorganized the entire house. And look at Alice. It's like she runs a business or something. Very, very impressed. Look at all this. Just a casual few thousand posters in my house. Nice. Shit, teamwork. Wait, have you nearly sent all the posters out? For people wondering where your 99.69 posters are, we're getting them all signed, everything. So rather than sending some out and then people being like, it's not fair, I've not got mine, I ordered mine. Like within one minute of them going on the website, we're sending them all out at the exact same time. So we should all get them at the same time. So here are a lot of posters that are done. We've got all these ones that we're working on. And uh, as you can tell, we've moved the office to my house just for the time being because Alice ran out of space and she didn't have, oh no, she ran out of space. She ran out of internet. So. Welcome Alice to the office. Now let me just jump in here real quick. After yesterday's vlog, everyone was like, oh my God, that's Tom's new girlfriend. That's his girl. He's been keeping her on the slide. He's finally showing her off. Guys, the girl who you've seen in the vlog, being Laura, is a family friend. And more importantly, Laura's 16 years old. So everyone in the comments was like, oh, Tom's definitely with that. Bet Tom's getting with her. Guys, I was cringing reading every single comment and there was a very large amount of comments that I was like, these are just inappropriate. So if you find yourself not being able to comment on my videos, um, congratulations, you got yourself blocked from ever comment on my channel ever again. You may have only been joking, but something that I strive to try and do here is keep, you know, respect to women as much as PewDiePie jokes about that and stuff like that. I'm very, very about removing anything that's totally inappropriate or anything like that. So I appreciate people who were flagging comments, like disliking them and stuff like that. So it like bumped them down and people didn't see it. But I was going out my way to actively block people because I get people's understanding of being like, oh, who's Tom seeing? Is he dating? Or oh, who's that girl we heard laughing in the background and all that sort of stuff. And, and for the record, I'm not dating anybody. And if I was doing, I wouldn't want to go put him on camera or anything like that. It's fun having a relationship and putting it online and stuff like that. But sometimes it's just the community gets a bit too much involved in it, giving their opinion on it of how I should do this or how I should do that or something like that. And I get it. It's like my life and I'm sharing it with you and you're entitled to your opinion and what I should do and what, sh what I shouldn't do. But sometimes when it comes down to a relationship, I just don't need to hear it. So I'm not in a relationship. And more importantly, I'm not in a relationship with Laura. She's 16 years old and she's basically my nephew. And I know you're gonna be like, wait a minute, doesn't that mean she's a man? I accidentally tweeted out yesterday saying that she was my nephew, not my niece. And I was soon to realize my mistake because the 19 million people who tweet me saying, ah, does that mean she's a man? Because I'm pretty sure you mean niece, came flooded in at me. So thank you for letting me know that. But I hope that cleared things up. Laura's just helping us out with Syndicate Original whilst we're doing all the posters. There's a lot of like mundane sort of jobs that are like a repetitive that need doing and doing and doing. And like rather than my mum and sister, they're doing them when they could be working on like the bigger projects. We're bringing extra staff to do it for us. So you saw her helping out today. She may be helping out another day or anything like that. But guys, if you do serious, the vlog please be respectful i don't want to go to my comments and see people being rude towards like basically family so if you do find yourself not being able to comment on my videos from now on or that goes for in the future if you said something that was like a bit edgy or you thought you were funny and i just thought it was rude the chances are i just blocked you straight away so take it as you want i'm just asking you all to be respectful but either way to everyone else who's just been super chill respectful flagging the comments you know like reporting them and stuff like that really really appreciate it you guys don't need to read too much into when there's a girl in my vlog i understand the suspense and the suspicion and all that but honestly it's really not needed guys if i was in a relationship and i wanted to share some like a part of my life with you than I would do but at this moment in time there's nothing that I want to be sharing with you guys on a relationship front because there simply isn't one but nonetheless we cleared that up so you may recognize I'm not in my house and I'm not in Manchester I'm actually down in London which you'll see me getting here in tomorrow's vlog because Alfie Day's message saying bro are you in the UK and what are you do Wednesday night I was like nothing and yes I am no and he said shut up we are filming a video for my channel 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. in Gloucester Gloucester yeah. Gloucester anyway can I get to Gloucester for 9 30 p.m or London, he says, we're traveling in a van that looks like this. Bruh, and I can't tell you what we're doing, but my response was, why just why? So damn, that's random as f and I love it. So tomorrow's vlog is gonna be epic. And I'm not allowed to say anymore, that's it. So on the bombshell, guys, I'm gonna end today's vlog because I'm currently just sat in a Costa Coffee in London, waiting to meet up with Alfie, and we're gonna go travel off to where we're going tonight. Again, I can't tell you what we're doing until tomorrow. So 
if I can, unlike today, get the vlog on time, it's gonna be an absolutely interesting vlog to say the least. I don't know how it's gonna pan out, I don't know if it's gonna go as we intended, but it should be spookily interesting. So, if you're excited, make sure you leave a like button, subscribe. If you don't follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitter, because I might suppose some teasers between now and then about it. And I will see you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. for the next daily vlog. I love you, I leave you, and it's adios. Yeah, I'm